the first formative years, frantic years as it were, because there was so much we need to do to get the structure right. And we're going to create a really special company that's multicultural, multinational. We're going to have a lot of fun and we're going to create a lot of value. One important part of the strategies is the component called the organization and people. The kind of culture we want to build, the kind of people we want to hire. The creation of a identity as a regional telco was a very exciting evolution. Uh, from where the international operations had been built up over one and a half decades. We realised that perhaps we are better off uh, separating the mobile business from uh, our fixed line business so that Asiata will be unleashed uh, to pursue growth into the region. Our vision itself inspires people to believe in building a regional champion. Asiata enables its employees to just be themselves. It's a corporate culture in itself. What I was most fascinated by was the diversity, foreign uh, participation in the board. The management team and their people inside their own organization will have to build their own company with their customers and their partners. People want to work for a company and mean something bigger and broader than, oh, it's a job. Uh, and it pays well. We have three measurements we're looking at from profit, people, process point of view. We call it the three P's. Then we said we are missing the fourth P, planet and society. Over the period since joining, I realised that Axiata has grown so much, far bigger than what I thought. That gives me a lot of uh, pleasure to see how they've been successful and all of them have been some of the best performers, if not the best performer in their respective markets. If there's one word you ask me to describe, I would choose the word resilience. The resilience in our people. Uh, Asiata to get where it is today has been immensely challenging, but I think, you know, Asiata has done a great job. As we evolve the mission of our company, we are pure digital play. Now we want to go with next generation digital champion. The pace of change being fast and being tech driven is, is here to stay. It's the new norm and, and that's not going to change. Early 2014, we were already contemplating what's next beyond regional champion. The most exciting thing about digital in general is that you know you have a blank sheet of paper to just about do everything. At that point, we have already embarked on this new program, building and investing into new digital company. I think Axiata has many successes uh, to show you know, the rest of uh, the Malaysian corporate sector. My wish for Axiata is for you to continue in your pursuit to be a regional communications company flying the mission flag. I'd like to think that uh, Axiata is a prototype of a Malaysian company of the future. Imagine if we take all the best practices from each of the operating company and put it together in the group. We can take anything that the competition is throwing at us. Small as we are, we are capable of the best and we can stand shoulder to shoulder. We stand tall with the best in the world. How then do you harness this into the next 10 years and beyond? And I think that is a challenge and therefore the opportunity.